The presence of the ROCA, Republic of Korea Army, at Fort Irwin's National Training Center is a first. When they had the chance to have cover, like the context for their presence, combined training with U.S. forces, is well established and growing. Hugely beneficial to me, especially as a commander in Korea right now, who may actually have to execute an operation uh, with an attached Korean force. It's been Captain John Flock is one of a handful of soldiers from the Korean-based 2-9 Infantry Regiment. Here is OCs, observer, coach, trainers. There's a lot of lessons that are being learned by both the uh, U.S. forces on how to bring this company into their battalion, and then uh, the ROC forces are really getting a lot out of it. It's a large training area, large uh, environment. So I think both sides are learning a lot of lessons. Just over 100 ROCA are taking part in the rotation. This dry run in preparation for a squad level live fire is just one of many training events they'll encounter over a two week period. 29 year old Captain Wong says for his soldiers in first company, NTC okay. is challenging, but they're learning how to plan, prepare and execute operations that will be fought together. Being here, he says, helps us identify the challenges we will face. The lessons and the experience I'm getting will be used in future operations. In the backdrop of NTC, combined training exercises and events like this strengthen interoperability and readiness for all. Gail McCabe, Fort Irwin.